Today is uh, May 16, 2023. I'm gonna show feeding my celibate hens. I just came off uh, winning the combine at 407 miles. And uh, we're 14 minutes ahead of the club, couple minutes ahead of the combine. We were um, flying against the wind. The wind was predominantly north. And I fly in the north. There's a combine winner right there to check her hen. And this is my other best flying hen. She's a five-year-old. She's been spectacular. As you can see, I clean the love once a week. I clean it on race day. I don't get crazy with these pigeons. And uh, they're a little bit hungry. I wanna show you how much I feed them. Is their feed. This can here is, uh, let's see, looks like 11 ounce. One of my best hens right there. She's been unstoppable, five-year-old. 11 ounce, I'm feeding a uh, depurative mix. This is what it looks like in the bigger can. Everybody's worrying about feeding. This is once a day. They eat once a day. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. These are my girls eating. There's about 31 hens. That's their feed for the day. When they finish eating, which will be fairly quickly, I'll walk them out front here. I'll spend the day out in a little fight pen in the front of the loft. And uh, my brother will let them in tonight. About 7 p.m. Again, I have a three to mile race. They'll eat this quantity of feed right through shipping day. And uh, for 300 miles, that's all they'll get. I'll fly them this weekend, and then uh, I'll start getting them ready for the 500. Hope you liked the video. Everybody's been asking about how much I feed. That's how much I feed. Frank McLaughlin, McLaughlin Wasps, please like and subscribe and uh, share my videos, and hopefully we'll have another good race. We've been having a great season with these hens so far. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.